Hey there folks, I am back with a new Challenge Cup for Wi-Fi Battle. My opponent is the Flaming Spade. Yeah, I just went through and battled pretty much everyone who I could in the um, Pokemosh Pit community because they all seem kind of interesting, or a lot of them seem kind of interesting. Anyway, I lead off with Glade. He leads off with Curlia. That's actually hilarious. Um, He's gonna go ahead and switch out into Shuckle. I get off a of Reflect, I'm like, yeah, this is a pretty good Glade lead, I've got Reflect, but I've got Black Sludge, which is just the worst item to have. I mean, it's, it's not the worst item, it has been banded and I could have not realized, but yeah, Black Sludge, not a good thing. So anyway, so not Snover, and you know, you didn't see it, but I saw my team, and my team is actually really cool. Uh, and I was thinking this would be a really great hail team, and it's like, uh, but anyway, so anyway, I'm uh, taking the shuckle down slowly. He sends out Weezing, and I'm a little bit worried about why he sent out Weezing. Go for the avalanche, doesn't really do very much. He's buff getting buffeted by the hail, and that's nice. I switch out here into Slowbro, um, predicting actually the fire blast, and it was actually really cool that he had the fire blast. Um, you know, there's really no way to predict that. Unfortunately, he also has the Thunderbolt. This is actually a really great wheezing for Challenge Cup. Anyway, I go for the Zen Headbutt. Does a lot of damage because it is super effective, but I'm not going to be able to take another one. Unfortunately, this is not a Regenerator Slowbro. Part of that is because with this version of Challenge Cup for Wi-Fi, there was a glitch and there is no such thing as Dream World Ability, or Dream World Abilities weren't programmed in. So yeah, that kind of sucked. But anyway, switch out to my Gotharita. Um, go for double team. Yeah, so double team is something that you can only really use in Challenge Cup. It's awesome to use it every so often to just piss off your opponent. Um, Alex gonna come live hard. I go for the uproar. Um, so that does a, doesn't really do that much damage, but I figure, you know, there's a good chance that I'll he'll miss me a few times. It doesn't miss me here. And that Sucker Punch did a lot of damage, and now I believe residual hail damage is gonna take me out. Um, maybe I survive? No, yes, I survive on two, which is great. And here his Sucker Punch does miss, so I am going to take out his live part, although it is going to cost me my Gotharita, um, because of that stupid hail <laughs> that I put up. Yeah, it's actually almost never a good idea, you know, whether it never works out the way you were hoping in Challenge Cup. Anyway, uh, on the blind switch I send out Snover, he hits me with a Psyshock. He's got really great moves on his Pokemon, I'm actually really surprised here. Uh, Snover is going to get called back, and I send out Seal. Um, forgetting actually uh, for a minute that Seal is just water type, not water ice. So I was a little surprised that it was buffered by the hail. Oh well, I have Swagger. Has Swagger misses, that's really too bad. And I'm pretty sure. Oh, Seal does survive with just barely any HP. Here I go for the Swagger, and this is again really obnoxious. Seal is now going to get taken out uh, with that uh, charge beam. Yeah, his Pokemon actually have really great moves considering this is a challenge cup for Wi Fi. Uh, I go for the Aqua Jet at that range of health. Yeah, I send out Dugong. Um, yeah, so I had both a Seal and a Dugong, and Dugong should be great in the snow, uh, you know, in the hail. Uh, so I'm gonna switch out Dugong, not wanting to, you know, sacrifice it just yet. He has the Grass Knot boosted by Grass Gem. Holy crap! This is the best Challenge Cup random ass team ever, for him at least. Uh, I'm just really, really surprised here. I go for the Ice Punch. Um, it actually, I get a crit and I take out a shuckle, so that's great for me. Um, Glade is losing lots and lots of health thanks to residual damage. Out's gonna come this Ursa Ring. I go for the Ice Punch again, I'm pretty sure that was my only really good attacking move. He KOs me with a Slash, uh, his Ursa Ring actually has a Life Orb, are you serious? Oh my god! Dugong's gonna come out, I go for the Icy Wind, um, it's going to lower his speed, uh, turns out I didn't actually need to lower his speed, I was expecting him to outspeed. Um, but, you know, that's the thing about Challenge Cup, you never know what these sets are. I go for the Body Slam, he does not die, and he takes me out with another Slash, and that is so lame. Uh, but so anyway, uh, now I'm down to my last Pokemon, which is Snover, he sends out Weezing, I know he's got the Fire Blast, and this is going to be a good game. So, great game, Flaming Spade, uh, hope you guys are enjoying Challenge Cup. So long.